Hi guys, in this 100 days I'm attempting to build a house completely from scratch. We're going to transform the Riverside Scrapyard into a magnificent house with running water and power. We're going to have irrigation and maybe even a swimming pool. For us to be able to do this, we have got the building menu mod with all the add-ons and the pipes mod as well and loads of others. So if you wanted to check them out, they're all linked in the description below. We are also only allowed to take materials in to the car lot. No pre-built items like fridges, generators or anything like that. But before we do get started, if you do enjoy my content please do consider going down and subscribing as it does help massively or maybe just drop a like instead now a quick word from today's sponsor are you looking to set up a project on wood server for you and your friends but not sure where to start well with today's sponsor indifferent broccoli all you need to do is click the link in the description or pinned in the comments and select how many players you want there is no confusing options and they offer a wide range of benefits including an easy to use control panel to make it as simple as possible to get started it really hasn't been easy with these guys it won't break the bank either as they offer very competitive prices and also offer a two-day free trial to test it out first with no credit card details required. So why not give it a go with the link below? Thank you Indifferent Broccoli for sponsoring this video. Now let's get on with it. Okay, we are back with a brand new 100 days run. Now in this one, as I said, we are attempting to build a house in the Riverside car lot. Now, the good thing is we've spawned in and we have literally spawned right opposite. So that is amazing. This was not planned, completely random spawn. Now, I don't know how busy it's going to be around. We are in Riverside. I've not been in Riverside in a while. Let's actually put on life and living because we're going to watch some of that, hopefully. Also turn the volume down as well. I have started with the starter kit and we are playing as Jim Taylor. Let me know if you know the reference. We have to start with some safety goggles and a mask. Traits, we've gone pretty normal ones here. Now, I have taken Carpenter, which is going to be good for Carpentry, because, of course, we do have the more builds menu. And the plumbing. So this is all going to be some interesting stuff. Now, let's just pause it here a second. Now, for this, we do need some high levels in Carpentry. What we got on Survivor. So we can even make a generator, but we need electrical. So electrical, we're going to have to build to level four, because I think for the appliances, we're also going to need level four as well. So. So yeah, we got a lot to. So the plan is we're not allowed to take anything into the car, only raw materials, all the structures and everything like that we have to build. We are going to just eat some of this stuff up because we do start with underweight as usual. I did start with a starter kit, so we do have a hammer because we are a carpenter after all. You'd have an hammer. I would have thought you'd have a, oh, let's have some granulated sugar. I would have thought you'd have a saw as well, but it's all fine. We can get all of that stuff. Now, what VHS is this? Washington High, not interested about that. Now, we probably will stay in this house just for the first 10 what oh we got Taylor in one which is a good start we will go out and look for some books and all that kind of stuff as we normally do and we'll get the helicopter out of the way the helicopter is set to just come once so we'll get that out of the way after the 10 we will move on over into car lot there so let's turn it so let's just clear the area to start with then looking forward to this on the end of the last season of the desert of copper state I was doing a little bit of building and this build mod is very versatile it looks and we got plumbing on as well so yeah it's gonna be good first things first we do need a watch so there's the car lot we could probably go and clear it out oh look at this we got a, a roadblock over here with the police as well all mods as usual are linked in the description so do check them out if you wanted to play along sandbox settings are all they're all pretty standard really Oh, we have found the key to the police car that's nice what's going on with the textures on these shotguns not too sure about that well, we do have vanilla firearms extended on or expansion. It's nice to not have to worry about the heat. We can actually wear some armor now as well. Any of these got a watch on. Now, we've also got mo crops on as well. So we should be planting stuff because with the pipes, we can have irrigation and everything like that. So it's going to be it's going to be good. It's going to be fun. I'm looking looking forward to it. No bloody watchers, though, is there? Or am I just being blind? Oh, and respawn is actually on on this run. Classic watch, we'll wear it for now. Can opener will take. Uh, at least we've got plenty of cars around us. Nightstick we will take as well. I think we get, do we get short blunt? Yeah, okay. Then maybe we go short blunt. I don't know yet, I don't know. Now the good thing about here is it does actually have a water dispenser in this cabin, which is gonna be handy, that's for sure. Oh, digital watch, okay. Now, we can actually build as well a well, which should be a quite nice water well. Yeah, what does that actually take? So, leveling commentary, it takes quite a bit, but that's why we spawned in Riverside, because we got all the warehouses, 
and everything like that. And I do like Riverside. Let's actually go back and see if we can catch a life and living carpentry. I can't remember if carpentry is on on the first day. I think it is. Because if we can get to level four, that's half the battle then. Do have tailoring here as well. Yeah, we got woodcraft on. So let's watch that quick. Okay, it didn't actually give us a level. But we also, we have the VHS store as well. So let's just turn this off, I think. Let's not worry about the programs because we'll only end up just having to stay in and watch it, which I don't really want to do. I want to go out and try and find some books because if we got the helicopter coming, you know we like to hunker down for that so let's just go and have a look for some some books we might need a new backpack or something like that maybe commentary two yeah well we're, we're nearly at the next level so we're probably not going to need that but we will have it anyway and we've got a flashlight let's attach that to our belt take a red pen as well matches yeah wouldn't mind a little hiking backpack or something like that from one of these houses that'd be nice so we have spawned in a really good place actually <laughs> probably the best place we could have spawned especially because we're close to the car lot but then also it's fairly quiet over this part of town all right, any of these jokers got anything good on them? Better dog food? Not interested in that, to be honest with you. Carrots? Yeah, we'll eat the carrots. And we'll also take your cigarettes. Thank you very much. A large empty gas can. We'll actually take it. Take your nails as well. Uh, what condition is this leather jacket in? Perfect condition. Okay, we'll wear that. Yeah, so the respawn is just set to the default respawn, which I believe is 72 hours. Oh, hey, we got a, we got a duffel bag here. Okay, let's take the duffel bag. We're on back. There we go. We can actually get rid of the school bag now. What else we got in there then? I got some 38s. Not really interested in them. He's got a key we'll take. Oh, we'll take this food as well. Look for a pan because we will be making some stir fries and stuff like that. And some pasta and stuff actually because it's good for the old calories, isn't it? We just could do with some books. That's what we need for when we have to uh, hunker down for the helicopter. And also a couple of sheets as well. <laughs> Okay, let's have a look in here, see what we can find. Oh, peanut butter, we'll actually eat that straight away for the calories. There we go. Take a bandage as well. Let's take another curtain just in case. Okay, well, our backpack is full, so let's go back and drop a load of stuff off. So, yeah, we'll put a sheet up here. There we go. Any other windows? So, the bedroom doesn't have any windows, which is amazing. All right, we've dropped all that stuff off. We need a smoke. Shall we Shall we go and see if we can get a car going? So, we might be able to make it to the bookstore, you know, before the helicopter comes, possibly. Surely one of these cars is going to have the keys and gas. Oh, leather gloves we will take, though. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Let's see how we get on here. I don't think we're equipped for this. Oh, we have keys for cars now. Do they have gas, though? No. Maybe this one does. Got a little bit of gas. Okay, this will do. The Ranger. Oh, we got some dead animals in there and some axes. Well, maybe we got axes. <laughs> God, a bloody alarm. Okay, so let's stop. Let's actually put that axe on our back because I think that's probably going to do more damage than our back. Oh, look at... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, we could be in uh, a little bit of trouble here. Let's turn the car off because it doesn't have a lot of fuel. We can kite some over. We may be able to deal with these. <laughs> what a start. We do have a stalker, though. Ah, oh, we just ripped the stalker jacket. Damn it. Ah, oh, we are getting tired now as well, which isn't good. Oh, no, not another alarm. Are you kidding me? I think the stalker knife actually is like a machete. So, right, we need to get out of here. Oh, God, this is not a good start. <laughs> yeah, the stalker knife does look like it counts as a machete, so that's good. We may have to sleep somewhere else tonight. Well, that's definitely put a spanner in the works, hasn't it? Let's stay in here tonight. We should be okay. Oh, bloody hell, okay. Okay, so there is a lot of Zeds outside, so we'll probably just hang around. Oh, we are sad, okay. We'll probably hang around just because we don't want to tangle with all of them bastards that have gone down to the car lot now. Not a great start. Where is... Oh, God, the bed's here. Okay, can we... Let's see if we can... Um, oh, we don't even have a saw. Hmm. Okay, right. We're going to have to risk it then, aren't we, here? Okay, it is 10 o'clock. We're going to risk on a bed here to hell with it. And we're, tomorrow we'll try and take back that area. We'll see you then. Okay, day two. We have survived. We are just going to get up and add it and get down there and try and reclaim our car lot. Now, the good thing is, as I said, it probably would have drawn all the bastards to us. Which I'm happy about. Especially how we found this stalker knife straight away. I mean, it's pretty much like a machete. <laughs> we will, of course, go back to the stalker to see if we can salvage any of his armor that we didn't uh, rip up with the axe. All right, come on, you bastards. Yeah, there is, yeah, there is a lot in there, but we should be able to take him, I think. 
Even though we're not moving in here straight away, we still don't want this many around when the helicopter comes. Oh, we're getting through them. There is still a lot, though. God, there is a lot. There is a lot. Look at them all. Let's try and spread them out on these cars. There's still so many down there as well. And we are now panicked. Oh, long blade up. Oh, bloody hell. There's still so many in here. Ah, oh, there's not that many left now, actually. Okay. Come on, you bastards. All right, well, that looks like a lot of them. Let's actually see what we can salvage from the Stalker. Yeah, that's got a hole in it. St oh, this boot's got a hole in it. Take your hood. Trousers have got a hole in it. Okay. Trap box could be good, actually. Okay, well, we've got some a little bit of armor we've also got the car now though let's go and get down being as we've got the machete let's see if we can get down and fill fill it up with fuel and maybe get in the bookstore actually no let's go drop all this stuff off we'll leave the base or we'll leave the trap leave the gloves i swear we had another axe or did we put the axe down somewhere oh maybe it's in the back of the car so okay that's fine right let's go and see if we can get some fuel and then also maybe get some books if the car will make it to the fuel station okay it's not too busy here for oh we haven't even got a weapon equipped bloody hell yeah, it's not oh there's some coming over now okay i spoke too soon oh they got that that armor yeah maybe we take that i mean that gas mask does a lot of protection yeah the t115 armor is it or something i can't remember we did have it on the i am legend playthrough trousers yes we will take can we attach and the boots we'll take as well can we attach that to something what what is this where okay yeah 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 like a little backpack's little fanny pack which is good because we don't actually have a fanny pack yet okay, i don't think we really need the shin guards or anything so this will do us all right let's fill up nice let's grab some bin bags armor here as well all right let's see if we can get in that bookstore today i mean the mail that'll do won't it we don't have to go so far down into town then especially if we park up here okay let's see if we can get in there and have a look at some books Oh jeez! All right, let's get a uh, let's get looting. Oh, and we also have the solar panel mod as well, so this is good. Teaches us to make wall mount solar panel. Yeah, that's very good. Thank you very much. Okay, so we have a hell of a lot of books. All of our bags are filled with books, and also our main inventory. We have some as well. Yeah, we got a lot. Oh, we can get out this way. I oh, know we can't. Now let's get the hell out of here. I think and get home. We got what we needed. All right, let's go drop these books off because we have a hell of a lot of them. How is our weight looking? It should be going up nicely. Yep, 71, that'll do. We got so many books. All right, let's fill up while we're here. They're a little bit hungry. Do we not have any pans? Oh, we do have a griddle pan. Okay, so we can make some stuff up. What is our food like, though? We should probably... Ah, uh, we got quite a bit, actually. Let's in the freezer. Let's move all that into the fridge. All right, let's go clear the area for the rest of the day, I think. Because there is some still around. Oh, yeah. This bastard's trying to get in our win. Hey, get out of it. Now, we are actually going to get tired pretty soon. So maybe we just read the magazines, I think. Yeah, let's just go over through all the magazines. Looks like we can make windows with this as well. Oh, with the building mod. Look at that. Precision vehicle windows and crafting. That's good. Okay. Yeah, the build mod's really good then. If it even gives you, you know, recipes to find in magazines. Okay, but it is 10 to 11. We're going to go to bed tomorrow. Yeah, we'll probably still keep exploring and clearing out rounders. Maybe try and find ourselves some more food, stuff like that. But we'll see you in the morning. All right, day three, we have awoken. Now, what I want to do is get up to Carpentry 4, which should be easy enough, I would have. Oh, we don't have a saw, do we? Right, okay. We need to find some garages. Oh, we got fog. Brilliant. Okay, so it looks like we got a couple of... Well, we got a garage there. Okay, well, let, let's go up anyway and see, see if we can find a saw or something like that. Maybe a shed up... Yeah, there's a shed here as well. Uh, like I say, the good thing is there are probably not going to be any zombies around. Oh, and it's open. Oh, look at this. We got a bloody... Well, no saw, but this thing here, this is the battery bank. Okay, let's put this on the map. Actually, we gotta, we've got to make one, haven't we? We're not allowed to, uh, to just take it. Okay, maybe not then. We'll come... Oh, we've got a screwdriver, which we need. So I think solar panels we can take. So stuff from that mod, but not the battery bank. We'll allow ourselves to take the solar panels if we can find any spawned, but not the battery bank. But we will mark it anyway, though. Yeah, we'll put a little battery with the thing on it there. There we go. So now we just need a saw. We never bloody had any breakfast, did we? <laughs> 
<laughs> I wanted to cook something up. Okay, well, well, we'll have supper. Take a screwdriver because we may need it to craft something, you never know. Now, one of these houses may have a little cubby hole that we could get a saw from, maybe. Don't, don't imagine so, because they are quite small houses, aren't they? But... Oh, crowbar we will take. We will take bloody two of them. So we will be looking in these houses then. <laughs> oh, we can grab some food in one of them as well. Yeah, we're going to need electrical four to build generators. So, And I imagine for the solar panels as well. So we better keep... Oh, we'll grab a cooking pot. Um, Yeah, so we're going to need... Oh, we'll see a cabbage. Cut cheesecake as well. Yes, please. Yeah, we're going to need electrical as well for to build the solar panels and stuff. We will eat the butter if we can. Oh, we can't. That's fine. We'll eat it in a second. Oh, we can actually dismantle dismantle the bed without a saw so we'll do that oh no the lamp we could dismantle oh and the bed worst case we can watch a bit of life and living there we go we got it from the bed nice okay all right that's what we wanted that's good that's good you know where we might find a saw actually in one of the cars in the car lot so maybe we go and check that out one of the boots possibly maybe in this boot oh come again to no yes please no no saw in there or in there right let's let's go back and look in the car lot okay we dropped all our stuff off let's go let's go into the car lot there still a lot of zombies around you know oh empty buckets yes we need that we'll take we'll actually take all of this that's good oh another camping canteen yes that's good we'll take this twine and stuff earbuds now yeah, we'll take the battery that's good so we got our camping canteens very early on all stuff we're gonna need i feel for the building of the house uh yeah we'll take all of that as well okay that's them on the bottom done there's a few more to do the stalker knife is taking an absolute beating, but... Oh, look at all this. Garbage bag. I don't know if we have it. Do we have a jack? I don't think so. Pipe wrench chips. That was uh, on a zombie, so... Yeah, we'll take it. I just got these last few to do here. Okay, no sauce. So what we'll probably do tomorrow, we'll actually go down the hardware store, I think. Yeah, so we're probably going to get tired soonish. Let's go and cook ourselves something up for tomorrow, shall we? What do we have? Let's make a stir fry. The house is an absolute mess, but it's fine. We'll we'll sort it out. We're not staying here anyway. Yeah, let's make a carrot and corn stir fry. Actually, we should probably eat the fresh stuff, shouldn't we? Okay, we got a chicken and sausage stir fry. <laughs> that'll uh, that'll do us. Look at that, 72 and 10, wow. All right, we don't need to eat all of that, do we? Let's fill our canteens up. Let's have a smoke. Oh, 72, 10, that's amazing. How is our weight? It's got to be, yeah, we're pumping, 72, good, good. Whoa, where did you come from, you bastard? Oh, we got some down here. Let's, let's deal with these. We are tired, but... Got any watches for me? No, you got earbuds though. We'll take that. Oh, I see a couple more sneaky bastards down here. Come on. Let's have ya. Okay, it's ten past ten. We're gonna go to bed. Hopefully we survive. We should be fine here. Tomorrow, we're going to the hardware store. We will see you then. Okay, day four. We have awoken. We're just going to... Actually, we're going to eat some of this bloody... Let's get rid of them here, buds. We're going to eat some of this, aren't we? Let's eat half of it. Lovely. Who will take it? Actually, do we need to take it down over us? Probably not. Let's put it in the fridge. There we go. Right. Okay, let's head down to the hardware store. Hopefully, we should be fine. We've got a horrible storm coming by the looks. And then we're hunkering down, I guess. Oh, it's so nice not having to worry about the temperature in the car. <laughs> from our copper state run okay so we're here looks like there's a few zombies not horrendous we should be able to take them take that handful and the disposable camera all good for electrical skill right oh we still got some more down here right let's get in the tool store glass pane mm, interesting i feel we probably need that for something i don't know what well the more builds mod but asphalt mixture Hmm, okay. Yeah, interesting. We will, of course, uh, we got the batteries there for the solar panels. Okay, now we will, of course, come back down here. Let's just get what we need, which is, of course, a saw, hopefully. We'll take some seeds. Ah, uh, welding mass we will take. Ah, saw, yes. Okay, we have the Holy Trinity. Propane torch there as well. Shovel? Yeah, we'll take. I feel we'll need that for something. Oh, and a sledgehammer. Look at this. Amazing. Yeah, so we know there's still a load of good stuff down here, like a load of batteries for the solar panels when we need them. Now, where is the pharmacy? Should we try and get in there and get some betas? Maybe even book naked as well. Try and find a generator magazine. Now, I imagine if you make a generator, you should be able to use it, but I'm not too sure. So we'll have a look anyway. Ah, uh, it's Enigma Books down here. 
let's get in. Let's see if we can find any mags that we need. Hey, lady, what are you banging for down here? Jeez. Foods around the world. Nice. Come on, how to use generator. There is that magazine up there. What's that? We've already read that. That's for the solar panels. Okay, now how to use generators, but it's fine. It's fine. Okay, we got bad weather coming in, but we just want to get in the farmer hook. Get some beta boppers. What the hell did this lady have in her back? Tactical tomahawk. Yes, we will take that. Okay, let's get in the farmer sale. There's a few Zeds in there by the looks. All right, let's see what we got then. Give me some betas. Probably take some painkillers. Oh, how to use generator in here, maybe? Antidepressants. Beta blockers. Four beta blockers, yes, please. That should do us for the uh, for the time being anyway. All right, let's get out of it. So yeah, I just love Riverside. It's literally got everything you need. Just lacking on gun stores, but then there is the little like service rest area place all the way to the west there. Perfect location to build a house from scratch. Now the plan is I do want to get plumbing upstairs as well. So we're going to have to cater to that because the pipes are always visible. So we may have to build them behind a wall. I don't know yet but we'll figure something out. And I haven't done any blueprints or anything like that. So yeah, who knows how this house is going to turn out. As long as I suppose we've got somewhere to sleep by the end of day 100, I'll, uh, I'll call that a success. Now, what have we got in the boot here? Oh, we got some food here, haven't we? Let's take that in. Yeah, the house is a mess. There's no getting around that. <laughs> okay, let's have some more of our stir fry. Okay, we've butchered all the animals. Nice. Yeah, so I think we might do a bit of trapping, actually, because we need a source of meat, don't we? Let's actually get some... Let's get some rabbit and make a stir fry up ready. Oh, who's this bastard? Hey, where are you? Get out of it. Oh. You got a watch on you, buddy? No. Look at that, we get so much meat off a rabbit. There's only a tiny little bit left, but we got three good... Actually, what I want to see is if adding four, like a like a cabbage salad, makes it... Gives it unhappiness. It does, but what about if we cook it? Turn that off. Okay, yeah, so four of something does give you unhappiness. Okay, that's good to know. How is our weight looking? 74, nice, nice. Okay, right, well, we're going to go to bed. And then tomorrow, yeah, we just got to hunker down because the helicopter could come. So we'll read all the books we need to. And yeah, go from there. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day five, we have awoken. So the helicopter could come at any time now. Let's just check the windows. That's done, that's done, that's done. So we should, in theory, be safe. Right, so I suppose we got to start reading, haven't we? Now, we're going to read the stuff that we're going to need first. So like carpentry free. We're going to need that electrical yeah we'll read the magazine also metal working i want to read as well what's in this bookcase not stuff we need okay okay that's fine so we'll put all of our red books there let's grab ourselves a nice bit of a uh, nice bit of game stir fry let's eat half of that lovely look at that we're doing it we're doing it Oh, yeah, let's read cooking one as well. All right, so first things first, I think we read carpentry because it's a long one. Let's get it read. Okay, that is carpentry read. Happy days. That's that done. I think we'll actually read cooking next, you know. Let's have a quick smoke. Oh, we did watch the cooking show, didn't we? That's why we're so high on this level. And look at this. Yes, yeah, so I've got a mod in which tells you more description of the levels. So this is actually quite interesting. So can build, can build, minus barricading time. Oh, look at that. That's very cool, actually. Yeah. This is definitely going to be one I, I use for a while. So level one gives you ingredients used, minus, plus more calories, and cooking speed. Okay, interesting. Right, well, let's read cooking one then. Okay, it is actually half past 11, so let's go to bed. Let's have, have we got more stir fry? Yeah, eat half of that again. There we go, lovely stuff. Is making us a bit unhappy, but it's fine. All right, let's go to bed tomorrow. Another day reading. We'll see you then. Okay, day six. We have awoken. Let's just get cracking straight away. Carry on reading. Let's do it. Okay, that's cooking done. Happy days. We'll actually cook something up as well, I think. So we're getting a bit hungry. What can we chuck in the stir fry then? Let's add rodent. More rodent and mm, add a bird there we go look at that and there we go it's cooked let's get it in us let's eat half let's have a smoke and then i think we'll read let's read electronics yeah so we've got all these watches and stuff to dismantle oh and we've actually lost underweight we're on 76 that is good we, if we're cooking all these meals we've got to keep an eye on our calories <laughs> especially if we're having game food okay that's electronics red let's get rid of that let's read metalworking 
Oh, geez, I didn't realize the time. It's bloody half past three in the morning. Go to bed. Right, we'll see you in the morning. Okay, day seven. We've woken up at half past 12. Had a little bit of a lion, but we was up late, so that's fine. Let's eat the rest of this. Okay, I didn't really do a lot, but that's fine. Right, let's finish metal working. Okay, metal working done. Let's get rid of that. Let's just read these mags so they're done. Okay, let's cook ourselves up something nice, I think. Got some sausages. Ah, leveling cooking. Nice, nice, nice. Add packed corn, yeah. Sausage and vegetable stir fry. Lovely. Sounds pretty good, actually. Okay, here we go. Lovely stuff. Now, I think we're probably going to have to read tailoring, aren't we? Oh, we got some magazines. Let's do these for the night. Then mechanics. Then... Oh, wait. Do we not have tailoring one? Surely. Seen it somewhere. I'm sure I picked it up. Ah, damn it. We don't. Okay. Or is it over here? Yeah, tailoring one. There we go. Okay, that's the magazines read. Now, we're not very tired. So, we probably try and set up to 11. Let's read mechanics. Let's read tailoring. Okay, it is 10 past 11. We're going to try and get to bed and get ourselves back in a routine. So we'll go to sleep and hopefully we got the helicopter tomorrow. We will see you then. Okay, day eight. We have awoken at 10 past three, which is not ideal. But it is what it is. So let's just carry on reading. Okay, we have finished tailoring. We're getting through them. We are getting through them. There's going to be a lot of book reading this run, I reckon, because we're going to need the skills as high a level as we can for building. But let's just start reading this anyway. Right, we are very hungry. So let's just finish this stir fry off. Have a smoke as well. Okay, that's mechanic done still no helicopter what else do we need then now i'm thinking trapping you know yeah i'm thinking we read trapping because we do have a trap so yeah let's do it okay it's 10 to 11 so we're gonna go to bed tomorrow day nine we need this helicopter to bloody hurry up but we will see you tomorrow all right day nine still no helicopter so far so let's have a smoke we've got to cook something up again haven't we because we're out of food do we have do we have anything to make a stir fry without opening anything no we don't okay so then let's have a carrot and chili stir fry chili there we go that should do us there we go that's all cooked let's eat half of that oven is off yep right let's just finish reading trapping then okay trapping done Happy days. I think what we'll do for the rest of the day is actually dismantle all electrical stuff. Okay, so all the stuff we dismantled, it gave us, what, half a level? Well... Just a third, I'd say. Isn't horrendous, but it could have been better. 18 scrap electronics, though. Surely they'll come in handy for something. Let's eat the rest of our stir fry. Let's have a smoke. I think probably we're going to have a lighter. We can light on the stove, though, which is good, thankfully. The water has gone off as well. Brilliant. Okay, let's do farming next. Okay, it's 10 past 11. Still no bloody helicopter. Hopefully we get it tomorrow, and then we can do a little bit at least. But, I mean, we've read the books we needed to read. We had to read them sooner or later, so. So, you know, it, it is what it is, really. But let's go to bed. Hopefully we get a helicopter tomorrow and go from there. We'll see you in the morning. Okay, day 10. We have awoken at 20 past 5. Surely that bloody helicopter's got to come today. But let's, mm, let's actually, yeah, let's read farming quickly. Okay, we just finished farming. Still no helicopter. Where the hell are you? Maybe I should have turned it off. I know we weren't about to have worried about it. But it is what it is, really. How about we make a soup? Yeah, let's make a soup up, shall we? Mushroom soup. Oh, you can't. Oh, that's annoying. I guess you can just, uh, wait a minute. No, I guess you, you can't. You have to add stuff to water. Maybe for the cooking pot. Okay, yeah, now we can make soup or a stew. Let's make a soup. Okay, we made our soup. It doesn't give us amazing amounts, but, you know, you can always add to it and stuff. So I think we'll be sticking to stir fries for the time being. Right, what else have we got to read then? Oh, fishing could be good as well, because we could grab ourselves some fish. We do have the river just to the north there. That's not a bad idea, you know. Okay, so we got the helicopter finally on day 10. I think it came on day 10 in our last series as well, didn't it? Hopefully it flies by. We will uh, We will see. I'm just going to fast forward a little bit. Yeah, it's definitely doing flyover, so that's fine. Okay, so it sounds like it's gone. We are very hungry. We're just going to grab anything here, really. Uh, just some mac and cheese. There we go. Right. Let's have a smoke. Now, I do want to just get out a little bit today. I know we've been stuck inside and the day's nearly over, but I do just want to get down to the car lot and just board the windows up. Corpses of despawn. We may have to cut a tree down. That's fine. We got axes. We are tired now, but uh, there's a couple of bastards around. Oh, I wouldn't mind his leather jacket. If it's, yeah, it's in good condition, let's wear it. Yeah, I do prefer them ones over these ones. We can rip that, that's fine. Right, let's go and board this up because we will be moving into here over the next 10 days. Oh, don't tell me all the bloody windows are going to be locked. Okay, we are in. Let's cut these logs up. Barricade the windows. Now, one saying I have changed with the build menu mod is that structures can't be destroyed by zombies. I just think I don't want to be messing around replacing stuff when all the zombies trash it. 
I just don't I don't want to be doing that because it was a nightmare in Russia with the fence so they can still attack barricades and stuff like that but just not the build menu buildings okay I think we are out let's get this corpse out of here so we'll use this as our little temporary accommodation until we do build a house we've got to clear this out we are going to scrap a load of these cars though I think let's just have a look what we actually need then to start making some stuff because I actually wouldn't mind a bed simple bed so we need a mattress okay and carpentry five so to make a mattress we need pillows can we make pillows yes we can rip sheet and stuff like that okay so we yeah we we can craft i hope everything that we need and we can get a jukebox going 40 scrap electronics jeez what do we need to build a well dirt bag stone bloody hell yeah we're gonna need a lot we can do that though that's fine that's fine we got uh we got options here all right let's just go and clear i saw a bastard wandering yeah let's go clear this bastard oh and here what do we need to build a gate here? This, we can put graffiti, garage stuff. Oh, I'm so looking forward to building this. Yeah, look, we can, now work in six. Oh, wow. So yeah, we're not gonna, uh, we're not gonna be able to build anything in here for a while, are we? But we can, can we not build a normal? Yeah, we can. So we may have to do that for the time being, just until we up our levels. But yeah, I'm looking, really looking forward to this run. Oh yeah, we need a lighter, don't we? Let's just have a quick look for a lighter. We'll go to bed soon, but check glove boxes for lighters. Probably should have been grabbing them as I was going, to be honest. But So yeah, we're going to have to cook all on the campfire, aren't we? Until we can build a cooker. Ah, matches, here we go. What is it to build a cooker? Metal working for... Oh, we could build we could build a barbecue or an antique oven. That might be the best bet to start with because that's just metal working for, whereas these need electrical free. Let's see if we can grab another lighter from somewhere. Nah, the hell with it. But we can, we can get a pool in here. We're going to have a garden. I might make a greenhouse and have the irrigation going in there so we don't have to worry about watering it. We can have all the kinds of plant sex. We do have most seeds, which adds a load of stuff. We'll get some foraging we get some traps going so we got woods behind us here yeah really looking forward to this but it is getting late so we're probably going to go to bed soon so we're probably going to leave it there for this episode so thank you so much for watching i hope you did enjoy it and i will see you in the next one cheers just want to say a massive thank you to all of our youtube members but a big shout out to everyone on the shambler tier john smith rob jones 309 basehead akuna whiskey mcdaddy too cool and self-serve thanks guys really do appreciate it